Why Min Min? After months of waiting, Masahiro Sakurai has finally put us out of our misery and revealed which character from ARMS is coming to Smash. Turns out it's not the game's most prominent character, Springman, but rather the ramen royalty herself, Min Min. According to Masahiro, this decision was made not by him, but by Kosuke Yabuki, the producer widely credited with the creation of ARMS. So why did Kosuke push for Min Min's inclusion over any other character? Well, it turns out that Kosuke's relationship with Min Min is actually something of a joke. In various interviews since before ARMS was released, journalists have asked Kosuke about his favourite character. He is not always consistent. He often mentions Springman, having sunk the most hours into playing the character, but he'll often use interviews to highlight other characters as well. For example, he once said that Twintel was his favourite, because her, quote, really strong build is rare for a character in a Nintendo game. As much as Kosuke may love Twintel, though, his most common answer when asked about his favourite is Min Min. Said Kosuke in one interview, Talking about maybe just purely from a favourite standpoint, I would say Min Min. I've said that quite a few times, I think, in interviews when I get asked that too. Usually Min Min. I think part of that, kind of the joke answer to why Min Min, is because I really like ramen. So apparently, Kosuke just likes to eat noodles and Min Min reflects that love. But it turns out, he's not alone in the ARMS development team of thinking Min Min is great purely because her family owns a ramen joint. When asked about his own favourite character, art director Masakai Ishikawa said, My favourite character in this game is Springman, but I also have to throw in a vote for Min Min. For Min Min, she's got a kind of sharp face, you know, sharper features, and she wears this badge on her chest protection that is the Japanese character for ramen noodles, and so I think just as a Japanese person, she feels the most relatable out of all the characters. In another interview, Masaki explained that this relatability also comes down to Min Min's choice of headgear, which reflected a fashion trend in Japan at the time. He said, Back when the character was in development, we saw a lot of women wearing shallow beanies over here in Japan. This was right around the time when we were thinking about a ramen-themed female character. It hit us that maybe we can cleverly combine this beanie fashion with an upside-down ramen bowl. That's how it got incorporated into the design. It's clear that the ARMS developers have a special love for Min Min, so it's hardly a surprise that, when asked by Masahiro Sakurai who should be included in the game, Kosuke didn't hesitate. According to Masahiro, Now, you might ask why Min Min out of all the fighters from ARMS. To be honest, it's because Mr. Yabuki, the producer of ARMS, said, I want Min Min. So it's just that simple. Yosuke wanted Min Min in Smash Brothers because he really likes to eat ramen. Plus, according to Masahiro, Springman is a bit of a dead end from a character branding perspective. Searching for him online brings up a Mega Man villain instead. It's understandable that Nintendo wanted someone a bit more relatable, and apparently nothing is more relatable than liking noodles. Masahiro's other favourite character from ARMS is Ninjara, who has been snuck in anyway as a Mii Brawler costume, just in case one ARMS character wasn't enough. In the meantime, it's Min Min for the win-win. <laughs> you did not just make me say that. In the meantime, it's Min Min for the win-win. Her character design and relatable, ramen fueled backstory won her a spot in Super Smash Bros. The moral of the story, clearly, is that we should celebrate the diverse talents and attributes that make people unique.